I would get rid of it just because, you know, it's kind of pointless. Like, I don't know really what it serves other than throw off our schedules. Patrick O'Neill and his family enjoyed the Sounders game Saturday afternoon in a comfortable amount of daylight, a sign of spring that is just around the corner, something Seattleites appreciate. Just at a very fundamental level, we need as much vitamin D as we can get in the Northwest. If, if to just abate a little bit of seasonal effectiveness, <laughs> like, we need to do that as much as we can, right? Americans want more sunshine and less depression. Senator Patty Murray on the Senate floor in November, urging Congress to let us permanently stay on daylight saving time. I don't know a single person who loves to go through the trouble of figuring out whether their microwave or their oven has the hour right. She's co-sponsoring a bipartisan bill, the Sunshine Protection Act, that would put Washingtonians on daylight saving time year round. No more changing clocks. In 2019, Governor Inslee signed state legislation that would allow it, but it still needs federal approval. Congress has to be part of the solution. Then there's the research that suggests being on daylight saving time all the time isn't healthy. Could mean higher rates of seasonal depression linked to lack of morning light during winter months. It's a huge burden to put on somebody to try to start your morning activity when your mind and your body are still not ready. Horatio de la Iglesia is a professor of biology at UW. He's done extensive research on sleep behavior. And he says, sure, daylight saving time allows for more light in the evening hours, especially in the summer. But in winter solstice in Seattle, the sun won't rise until closer to 9 a.m. De la Iglesia says school children would feel the impacts. Most of their days of school during the year would be in the dark. They would walk into their first period in the dark. I don't know about that. <laughs> I'm not a grown up. Kids like Isla, meantime, would like to sleep more if they can. So usually I like to sleep in, so I would prefer sleeping in. And not have to worry about changing time at all. I mean, it's not the end of the world, but at the same time, it's like, why don't we just get rid of it? Federal law allows states to opt out of daylight saving time, meaning we'd be on standard time all year round. States like Arizona and Hawaii have already opted for this. Back to you.